welcome from our partners. I, I mentioned that we have the intersectoral forum where we're working together with the civil society, our donors, and also our institutions uh, talking about ECD matters. So I would like to welcome UNICEF, uh, Memorial Mafiko, to give a message of support for ECD. Over to you, Mayor Muriel. Thank you very much, uh, Program Director Nyabonga Kakulu. I'm so delighted to join the handover ceremony in me in Langa. In Swaziland, a few years ago, we used to spend a lot of time in the Mpumalanga province. So, like uh, my sister who spoke earlier about her connection to the province, I also feel I have that connection to the province and can relate to, to the province, having spent uh, some time, uh, there some time when, there, I was, uh, when I was in. I would like to, first of all, thank the organizers. Thank you for organizing this event during very unusual times. But I think by having this event, we are confirming. We are confirming our conviction that the best investment we can ever make for children, the best investment we can ever make for a country is to invest in its children. And that is why today's event is significant. It is significant because it brings many players. We have heard from the introductions and I would like to adopt the protocol that has already been established. We have the traditional leaders that have been mentioned. We have our deputy ministers from ministry, different ministries, education, social development. We have our partners from the uh, national lotteries. We have our community people, the people who are at the center at the center of raising children and providing a safe environment. So all that speaks to the importance of partnership in raising children. Indeed, the African saying which says, it takes a village to raise a child. It is so true and we see it even at today's event. I would like to acknowledge the partnership that we have. UNICEF has been partnering with the Department of Social Development, with education and many other uh, partners for many, many years. In fact, we go back almost two decades of partnership. And it's because we have a shared belief that if we invest in early childhood development, we are building a strong foundation. Someone earlier mentioned foundation. So we are building a strong foundation and that foundation begins with the brain development, which is so critical in the first few, few, few years of a child's development. So we are partners in this building project, building a healthy future, building a prosperous future, and also building a future that is equal. So if we believe in reducing inequality, if we believe in reducing poverty, and if we believe in creating opportunities for employment for children, it all begins with quality early childhood development. That is the foundation of all foundations. Everything else that follows only comes on top of a strong foundation. So we know from science, it is very clear. The early years of childhood form the basis of intelligence, personality, social behavior, and capacity to learn. That is what science tells us. Science also tells us that brain development is most rapid in the early years of life. And that's why it's important to do the right things during that critical period. We further know that the effects of early disadvantage on children can be reduced through quality early childhood development. Another thing that we know from science 
is that when we invest in early childhood, it is not a cost. It is an investment. So the early years of a child provide us a tremendous window of opportunity. It is a window of opportunity that exists, but only for a moment. And therefore, it's important that we maximize that window of opportunity, which is there and it, it creates an opportunity for us to really make sure that children have the best start in life. By investing in early childhood, and this has been said time and time again, the impact is lifelong. So it's not just the results that we see in the early ages, but the impact lasts a lifetime. And that's why it's the best investment we can ever make. We also know that investing in early childhood development gives us the highest returns uh, that we can ever get. So when we invest in children, we know that we are bringing up a generation of people who are also going to give back. They are going to get better jobs. They are going to be more balanced adults, and they are going to be in a better position to contribute to their society, contribute to their country. So the returns are substantial and they are intergenerational. So that is why we are all here today, because we know that investing in this critical period of a child's development is the best decision that we can ever make. I would like to share with you four keys, four ways in which we can unlock children's potential. The first key is to invest early, and that is what we are doing. And thank you to the partners who have come on board to invest early and give every child a fair chance, no matter where they live, no matter where they come from, giving every child a fair chance and a good start in life. The second key is to invest equitably because the children with the least benefit the most from early childhood development. So equity has to be at the center of what we do, reaching those who are left behind. Then the third key is we need to invest smartly. It's not only investing in education, but also in health, in nutrition, and in protection. It's really about an integrated approach. That is what is needed. And we see it today by the partners who are attending this event. The last key is that we invest now. We do it now, not tomorrow. And again, that is why we are here today. So thank you to the partners who have come on board. Indeed, it takes partnerships. It takes parents, ECD practitioners, communities, traditional leaders, and today's event is an example of partnerships that are needed in order for us to give every child the best start in life. So on behalf of UNICEF, I would like to take this opportunity to congratulate the Department of Social Development, Education, our partners from the lotteries, and everyone else, the traditional leaders, the parents, the community, the caregivers, the ECD practitioners, everyone. This is the best decision we can make to invest in South Africa's children. Thank you very much. From UNICEF, I think it's very important as partners to mention Uguti role in Lalwa UNICEF in terms of lobbying. Uh, we improve the experience of an African child. Uguti, a child in the village also has got the same opportunities as the child with my suburbs. So we thank you for those wise ways.